What is going on YouTube? Today I'm bringing you some PTCGO gameplay. I'm going to be showing you guys my baby blounds list. It's not mine. I got this from Andrew Mahome. Um, there's a video out there on his his list. A little bit different. I think there's one card different. It's the Fion here. I don't have the Tapu Fini, I believe it is. Uh, so I'm using Fion as a switch option for a whirlpool section. So it's a pretty straightforward deck. Uh, got Cremorant V for sniping. Most likely Dedenes off of the bench with Spit Shot, which is easily chargeable with the welder and attachment. So in a single turn you can get that charged up to 260 to knock off Dedenne off of the opponent's bench. Playing three baby blounds, baby blacephalons, which is our main attacker. Three fire energy for fireball circus. Discard any number of fire energy cards from your hand. This attack does 50 damage for each card that you discard in this way. So naturally all of our trainer cards are ways to get energy. We have a big blounds. Got a big blacephalon. Blacephalon GX. Which this is the final turn killer when you have it able to search it out you can use bursting uh bursting no not bursting burn sorry burst gx for one energy and it pulls the last prize card from your prize card pile for the win playing four jirachis playing a zacian for when there's nothing else to do in your turn if you got zacian out you get uh intrepid sword for three three cards in your hand Mew to stop Pikaram from uh, bull blitzing. Tag bolting, that's what it is. That's what it is. Tag bolting. Tag bolting uh, our bench. Mew 2, so that way when you play this Pokemon in your hand onto your bench during your turn, you play a supporter card for your discard pile on, your, on top of your deck. So this way, if we've used a welder, we can get it back on into our deck and pull it with our many pull options. Oricorio main bench function dance of tribute once during your turn if any of your pokemon were knocked out during your opponent's last turn you may draw three cards you can't use this more in here so when they start knocking out pokemon we could start using oracorio's gx to get more cards into our hand like i was saying i play Fion for a a the whirlpool section which lets you switch lets you make make them switch their pokemon uh, they get to choose though because I don't play any any boss's orders. I do play one great catcher though for the GX that are in play Playing four energy retrievals to get them out of the discard pile four fiery flints four fire crystal One ordinary rod in case it goes deep into the match and I have to pull out some more Blacephalons if they got knocked out which I'm sure they do for Quick Ball, since all we're playing is basic Pokemon. Uh, I don't have enough scoop up nets, so I'm playing two scoop up nets and two escape boards instead of four scoop up nets. Four switch, heat factory, ultra space to pull Blacephalon whenever I need to, of course, four welders, and I'm playing 13 fire energy got to remember that because when we go looking through our deck we got to make sure we have enough because for the biggest knockouts of something like a Dragapult V Max or anything like that it's 320 so we're gonna need seven energies in order to one hit KO them so let's jump into some gameplay here with our baby blouse deck Now, I usually like to go second, just because I like to donk the other person occasionally, if I can get the right hand, get a uh, Blacephalon and a Welder and just knock it out straight out the gate on turn, my first turn, which is always kind of mean, but quick, quick and easy wins, that's what we're going for. Now, the point of this deck is, is you want to try and limit 
the two card prizes that you put out. So that way you're playing a single prize deck while you're knocking out their two and three prize Pokemon. So here we actually have a pretty good start here. Got Fiery Flint and Welder. Not enough to to get the knockout. But we'll see what Welder gets us once we attach it. Mewtwo Mew. Okay, so we got... We'll get rid of Energy Retrieval and switch since we don't have anything right now anyways. Pull our four energy. We're going to attach our two, get our three cards. <sighs> Only two. And I use a switch, so let's just knock into it. See where they go from there. Oh, I should have put down my Blacephala on that way if they do knock it out. But I don't think they can. Because they can only do three energy. And that takes four. Oh, Turbo Strike for two energy. Oh, no. So there we go. Make sure to put them down now. Now we can pull our fire crystal to pull these two back out. So we can do another 150 damage. Which still isn't enough. I'm gonna have to do that because I don't have no other move. Now let's see what they they can do. They, Looks like they're playing some variant of a Mewtwo Mew Fire deck. So that means they're gonna have discarding their GXs so that way they can use Mewtwo's ability as Welder. Going to Mewtwo, I would assume. more discards. Giant Hearth, that helps us. So now we can get our energy back again. Uh, let's discard an energy to get two. We got that's 200, and it's got 30 less damage, so 270. I would have to do six, four. Now let's take out their breaks in and Charizard for three prize cards. Great catcher. So we can great catcher up there. Pressure on a Charizard and force them to use Switch if we need to, if we don't get enough. So if I if they knock out Blacephalon, I'm probably gonna use the Quick Ball to pull up or a Choreo. not sure what they're doing, but what we're going to do for our turn, because they know if they knock out Blacephalon, we'll quick ball to Oracorio. Uh, if they don't, then that puts us in a total different situation. Power plant. Okay, so they did. I'm going to put Jirachi up. Definitely going to put our heat factory out. Definitely want to 
want to use our energy retrieval to get as many energy as we can. Heat factory. That way we can discard one, get three more, and a fire crystal. That is like perfect. I just need. They don't have a Dedemi, but that would not matter much. Anyways. So we're, we're going to go ahead and get the little choreo so that way we can dance a tribute. Everything we need is to so a welder to Placephalon. Third down. The skateboard. Fire crystal. Those three. Retreat. Fireball circus. 100, 200, 300. For the win. That's a good match. That was that was exactly what we wanted. Let's go on to our next one. Not all of them fare that well, but that was I want to say a pretty good usual matchup. Unless we hit a single single prize deck ourselves, then, then we start to struggle, because it's meant to do a lot of damage, not take out a lot of Pokemon. That seems to happen a lot, too. Get mulligans. you guys this got another three pack blister booster pack that I'll be opening it'll be episode two of grudge beard he'll be back searching for the gold searching for the buried treasure okay so we got Jirachi we'll use stellar wish we got welder one energy two energy so that's good we got a skateboard, so we're hoping for a quick ball. Ooh, perfect. Quick ball. Gonna do Demi. Oh, I went first, so I can't. I didn't realize that. So what I'll do is quick ball for Zacian. And Intrepid Sword, just so I can get more cards in my hand. Oh no, now I just need something to attach it to, because that is a good hand. Welders, Fire Crystals, Fiery Flint, Cherish Ball. Are you playing Pika Rap? What are you playing? Oh, ADP. Must be metal. Deck. I didn't pay attention to what it was. Energy spinner, water energy. Start charging up for that altered creation. Tool scrapper. Oh no, my escape board. How rude. Oh no, I'm Arnie. So, anything that resets my hand is, is a really bad matchup for me. Well, there's Ultra Space that gets us our. A cephalon, but that doesn't do much in the way of energy. Uh, okay. So let's get. Oh, and we got two of our Bocephalon prized. That's not good. So we get a Stellar Wish. Do me any good. So 
whiffed on it. Oh, whiffed on it. Let's draw six new cards with the Dene. Okay. Now I... Let's do this. Treat. This Jirachi. Ooh. Do we want a heat factory? Yeah, let's heat factory. Pull a heat factory, use our one energy. Oh no! Cause I already used ultra space. So. Put down our third Jirachi. Switch to it. Fiery Flint. There we go. That's it. Fire energies. So Fiery Flint, probably the Mew and the energy. Pull four. Welder. Getting super aggressive here. Ooh, how many do we have in here? We have one. But again, we have no switch. So. Let's. Oops. Let's. Trip sword. See what they got. So they're gonna alter creation, which is alright. Which means they don't get to attack. Which is perfect. Mm -hmm. Which means that we can knock them out for three. So there. They are 280, so we need six fire energies. We got two, and the fire flint needs at six. So we're looking pretty good on energies to knock out ADP. Alter creation, you're gonna attack. Okay. Okay. So, we got our plan of attack. There's a welder. Actually, let's spell our wish first. Let's scoop up that. So I got one fiery flint, one energy. So I'm gonna want something to pull from the discard because after I do this, I'm gonna find the discard. Uh, what do we want to discard? Discard Jirachi. Now we do, so if it does get knocked out. Now if we have any gusting options, we can gust up Zacian. For, oh well, no, we could do it to Dedenne too, and then we got big blounds for our final prize card pull. Okay, well there goes our heat factory. So they have altered creation, so they will be getting two prize cards from our one prize. And Three from our two prize Pokemon. Play no, play no three prize, so they don't get four. None of that mumbo jumbo, or super ultra extra prize card pulls. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, no order, pal. So what you got? Church ball. 
Hey, alternate art to Dene. Check that one out up here. Uh, that is the toolbox, which I'm actually playing too, as you can see from the the uh, deck card deck coverings. Same ones they're using. These come from the. Oh, I actually have it sitting right here. Those come from. Oh, they gave up because they knew those come from that. Toolbox. Trainer's toolkit. They knew once their ADP got taken out, they had no chance. Which is what I like. The, the one hit KO ability of Baby Blondes is so huge. I think we'll do one more win or lose, and that'll be. That'll be it. I like in the, the two games that we had. If you guys want to uh, comment down below what your favorite PTCGO deck is, what combination. I'm really excited for Darkness of Blades to come out in August. I really want to try some of the combinations from there. Uh, since my main deck really is Pikaram, some of the big cards that will be rotating like Thunder Mountain and Electro Power. So not going to be quite as explosive. So I want to try out some of the new things that we'll be getting in Darkness of Blades. So they have Fire Water deck box, so I'm wondering what they're playing. Oh, they're playing a Placephalon. You guys are going to see how much, how bad I am at this matchup. I have not quite gotten around to beating a Mirror deck yet. Okay, uh, let's see what our options are. Nothing to search for Pokemon. Definitely don't want to discard our hand. Um, let's put down big blounds. I, I never get good pulls when I'm facing mirror decks. It's so frustrating. Gonna have to untrap the sword. So mm, apparently they didn't have a welder. Or they could still put a welder, but then they'd have four energy on Placephalon. Or they could welder one. Just waste of a welder. They're gonna Intrepid Sword now. Yep. Okay, let's see what our top deck is. An energy. So let's do that. Got a welder. But we don't have anything to attach it to. No switching options. I don't want to do mind blown because. Well, I'm going to have to do it for one because I have no other option. Fire energy and get a baby blounce so I can finally get a baby blounce on the board. Okay, there we go. And then burst GX. So at least we took one prize card. Yay! Alright, I'm gonna attach it to Blacephala. So we know we're gonna top deck a welder next turn. We got Fiery Flint, one, don't want to really use Fire Crystal because we'll be wasting two of the fires. Tidy. 
Also, a future video. Got a Pokeball here that'll be opening. Yeah. It's got some packs in there. Okay, you use Fiery Flint. Let me pull that Oracorio. Ah, oh, see, Tapu Fini. Tapu Fini is what you want against a mirror. Which I don't, because it's one energy in Ultra Beasts. And does 100 damage. Yep, it's gonna knock out. Okay. One prize card behind. Are we gonna top deck? Oh, I guess not. <sighs> Sometimes I have to frustrate myself. No switching options. No nada. No switching options still. I get really bad poles. And he could just continue to one energy, 100 shot. All my fires. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? the advantage with the water out. Taking two out with Tapu Fini is like ideal situation. Okay. Still no switching options. Oh, there we got a scoop up that. be able to use Heat Factory too. Got a great catcher, but no... Uh, I'm just gonna have to concede. I, I just can't get anything. <laughs> well, two out of three. I guess that was pretty good. If you guys like the PTCOG, PTCGO gameplay, smash that like button let's try and get this to 10 likes we were so close on the last video to getting it to 10 likes um if you guys like pokemon and all of its content go ahead and hit that subscribe button it's gonna be gameplay and lots of pokemon so that's gonna be a positive if you want follow me on twitter at grudged g i post a lot of side card and and life stuff like today i posted my unlimited base unlimited charizard i'll be posting a lot of my uh, pokemon on there and, and putting some polls out there so yeah other than that grudged out